That's right. We're back. We're back because Frost. Frost has decided to go after not only Henry Cavill, but also going after Gina Carano, going after two of the most popular people on the Internet. And this is what happens when you destroy an entire company, when you destroy an entire company and then you lose your own job and you have nothing else going for you whatsoever. This is the life of Frost. This is all she has to look forward to for the rest of her life on the internet because she has destroyed her reputation so bad that she is now at the point where all she can do is have horrifically bad takes about people that are far more successful and relevant than she will ever be. Welcome to your new life, Frost. This is what happens when you get elevated based on identity politics and then no one's there that manages these people and tells them hey you might want to back that off you might not want to attack the fans you might not want to completely tank the entire company no you, they just let SJWs run wild and now Frost is at a point where she's just there to make horrifically bad takes on the internet now this is all starting because Henry Cavill recently stepped away from The Witcher. Now, three seasons into that show, literally the only reason anyone was watching it was because of Henry Cavill. And Henry Cavill is one of the most popular and respected actors in the industry, rightfully so. He respects the fans, he respects the lore, and he gives outstanding performances. So fans really appreciate him. So when he stepped away from The Witcher, and a lot of people speculate that that's because, obviously, he's returning as Superman, which I think is fantastic news, by the way. There was a big discussion about it online, and Frost decides to bring an old Me Too comment that Henry Cavill made years ago that really never gained any traction whatsoever because Henry Cavill's not on Twitter, so he's not there for all the weirdos that pretend that they're offended by these things to tag and cry about or whatever, so it kind of went under the radar. But if I'm remembering correctly, essentially he said something to the effect that he was kind of scared to approach women because of the Me Too nonsense that was going on. And that did get a little bit of controversy at the time, which it should not be controversial. If, if anything, it should show you how ridiculous the industry was reacting to a lot of this stuff. And it kind of went away. And now Frost is trying to reignite that conversation because she's a completely irrelevant piece of trash. And then someone in her comment section brought up Gina Carano because Gina used to date Henry Cavill. So now she's going after Gina. Now, of course, she's upset about Gina because that's her NPC downloaded uh, program. But what about Susan Sarandon, someone that literally just said exactly what Gina was fired for? Fired and shamed by Disney and Lucasfilm. But of course, Susan Sarandon has the right politics, so it's completely okay. But right here, I retweeted her take. And I just said, thank you for another terrible take. Never change. And right here she says, Henry Cavill said some very questionable things around me too and dated a 19-year-old as a 30-plus. Seeing people throw themselves at his feet for the Witcher is weird. The show is whatever at best. She continues on, though, because someone in her comments brought up Gina. Uh, right here. Not to mention he dated Gina Carano, who famously sucks. And she goes, there I Google her. Oh, no. And Frost is just full of horrifically bad takes after bad takes after bad takes. So here's what she said about Gina. Uh, it is big yikes energy. I just discovered he also dated her. And so I retweeted, Frost isn't a clown. She's the whole damn circus. Again, this is a person that G4 paid and put as a as a focus of their network. This, this is, this is what these, these weirdos do in the industry. And so now Frost is at a point in time where all she has in life is to be ratioed on Twitter for her terrible takes, because that's exactly what's going to happen. You're going to be ratioed to hell and back because no one likes you, Frost. No one. You destroyed a company and then when other people were laid off because of you and your mouth, you celebrated keeping your job only to lose your job a few days later. And then a few weeks later, the entire company shut down because they wanted to elevate weirdos like you. What a horrible person this is. And everyone knows it now. Everyone knows it. You know, for the longest when we would call out Frost, you had all these weirdos that would sit there and cry and whine and say, oh, you guys are just making this up. Everyone loves G4 and Frost. No, 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 they didn't. 
and now the company is out of business and Frost has no job. And now she's just here to make horrifically bad takes. That's what Frost does. We were right again. The fans will continue to stand by people like Henry Cavill and people like Gina Carano because they're really cool. And they seem to appreciate and respect the fans. And that's all fans are looking for. You guys have a great day. Thank you very much for checking out this video. And we will talk to you later.